Hey, YouTube. Well, I smell a, uh, a stunt. Okay, I'm going to talk about this story with, going on with uh, Jamal Bryant, uh, New Birth in Atlanta. So apparently, they have decided to give the money that Kanye West donated to the church, to give it away, to give it back to his mother's, the, the, to the school where his mother taught school, right? This was Morris Brown Morris Brown College, which is an uh, historically black college, right? I think I smell something bad uh, going on here, <laughs> or maybe just something business. Okay, the whole world knew Kanye West's views. The whole world was exposed to Kanye West making a fool out of himself since Donald Trump came into office, right? We all saw him tap dancing around the White House for Trump's pleasure. We all saw all of this, the, the, him hugging him and calling him, I don't know, some kind of second savior. We're all aware of that. Certainly Jamal Bryant is aware of that. And yet he had Kanye West come and give his church service there at New Birth Church, right? So my question is, why would you have Kanye West, if you feel that strongly about his political abuse why did you have him perform there like the old people say or the the old saying goes follow the money okay so all we know is kanye west made a donation to the church now we don't know how much money the church took in at this church service every ch black church service i've ever been in there was a collection there's always money involved right so is he saying he's taking all the proceeds from that, from that event and giving it to this college or he's just giving to this college whatever to, uh, Kanye donated. Donated is not the same as the pay or as the tithing offerings. Did they collect at that, at that event? Was it a free event for the community? How was money made at that event? If the Kanye West event is packed to the rafters, this is some thing that he's doing, the, these the various big, big churches, right? So did they keep the money that they made from the event? Did were, If there were donations made, were they kept? And then they just, they're just giving away Kanye's donation? A donation had nothing to do with what was taken at the gate. Did they charge for this event? Were their tickets sold? If there were no ticket sold, were there honorariums collected? Offerings collected? Every black event I ever been to, you didn't just walk in there and walk out with the same amount you had in your pockets, right? So I don't know. I think this is suspect. I think it's suspect. How much was this donation? And what? Did this, how much was actually made at, at the event? So they took him in for whatever... Uh, a uh, new birth reasons for taking him and letting him perform there. Whatever their reasons was for allowing him to, to uh, perform there. Why would it change after he gave a donation? A donation. I can give a donation. Okay. Let me write you a check for a thousand, two thousand dollars, whatever. Chump change for these people. So you, you gave it to the school. So what? How much was made at the event? That's what I want to know. If not, if you gave it away, then what was the, the tax write-off? How much did you write off? The whole thing? This is suspect to me. This sounds like a stunt. They're getting publicity now for being doing the honorable thing and giving the donation away. I think the key word here is his donation. Not what it was collected at this event. Not if there were tickets sold. Not that. Not if, if this place was packed, that place, I mean, New Birth holds, what, 3,000 people? Nice piece of change. So unless he's willing to say, we gave all of the, the, the proceeds from that event and donated it. Produce receipts and the amounts, then I am not impressed with this. Uh, I'm not totally against uh, uh, Jamal Bryant. I think he's done a wonderful job with New Birth, bringing it back to life. 
But I think this is also a business person. And there's a calculation here. Why would he bring him in there and then insult him by giving his money away? So we don't want your money. Isn't the money that he the given, wasn't that collected from, from the congregants? Uh, is their money dirty? All they paid for was, was a singing event. So, in conclusion, I don't believe it. I think this is a stunt, publicity stunt. I don't think he actually insulted that man by giving his money, gives money back. And a donation, a donation is it got nothing to do with how much money was actually collected at this event. So don't be fooled, people. Yes, Jamal and Bryant, I understand, is doing a good job there. But a stunt is a stunt is a stunt. All right? So maybe some more will come of this story later on. People tend to run their mouth later on, you know. Secretaries or people involved in the thing. They'll come. They'll tell us what really happened. But some kind of way, some kind of way, that church profited by him being there. It was not he came there and gave the proceeds from that event, gave it to the school. I don't believe it. Like I'm like doubting Thomas. Show me the receipts. <laughs>